Hello class, welcome back to Viva Barca and welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on the latest developing stories. We are going to begin with Usman Dembele who is currently injured as it has been reported that Barcelona are impressed with the injured forward professionalism and wants to recover as soon as possible. We are going to be discussing on that as we progress. Then secondly, talking about La Liga president Javier Tebas, as the La Liga president continues to attack Barcelona by recently saying that Joan Laporta is seen ghost. We are also going to be discussing on that. So guys, as we get right into the full story, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch right up to the very end. Barcelona have been rocked with injuries this year with the likes of Pedri, Robert Lewandowski, Usman Dembele, Frankie de Jong and most recently Andreas Christensen also coming into injuries since the turn of the year. Dembele has been one of the most notable absences for Barcelona as he looks to miss out on the club's upcoming second leg tie against Real Madrid in the Copa del Rey semi-finals. The Frenchman was expected to recover much earlier, but his recovery progress did not go as planned. As such, he is not expected to return to the pitch in the coming weeks and therefore will be ruled out against Real Madrid. However, a recent report from Dario AS Suggest, but Usman Dembele has appeared very committed in his bid to return to action. The forward goes to Suita Desportiva every day to train, sometimes even voluntarily. His actions and his commitment have impressed the onlookers within the Barca camp. The former Borussia Dortmund starlet is determined to get back to the pitch after missing no less than 11 matches in all competitions. His last game came against Girona in late January. With 8 goals and 7 assists, Usman Dembele was the second most potent player for Barcelona after Robert Lewandowski, but his injury has left Barca relying heavily on the services of their defensive unit. But with Christensen ruled out, Barcelona need their star players such as Pedri and Dembele as soon as possible as they look to not only end the season on a positive note but also clinch a domestic double. Unfortunately for Xavi Hernandez though, things only keep getting worse, with even the young now in contention to miss the second leg tie against Real Madrid in the semi-finals of the Copa del Rey on April 5th. So Usman Dembele is still out injured as we all know and uh, of course hoping that he comes back as soon as possible. Even though he was supposed to return against Madrid in the semi-finals of the Copa del Rey, but unfortunately reports came out that his injury recovery had been very slow than expected. And of course, Usman Dembele will still be out for much longer, which is not good news for us, the Barca faithfuls. So we just hope that he keeps, you know, trying to train as he has been doing individually all this week and the reports are saying that Barcelona are really impressed by his professionalism, by his commitment to recover faster. That shows that he really loves the club and he really wants to recover fast to help the club you know, to win matches. Of course, without Usman Dembele, Rafinha have stepped up his game and I think that is why Barcelona honestly have not really missed Dembele like what so many people thought it would look like because Rafinha has picked up form and other players as well. But honestly, I think our defense is the best part for us this season. I think if we want to win the league title, it's all about the defense because they have been doing so well. They have been doing a fantastic job as compared to the offense. And I think that thanks to them, we are where we are right now when it comes to domestic competitions. We are doing really well and we're not even missing attacking players who are out injured like Dembele. Um, so let's hope that Usman Dembele recovers with action from from action, you know, as soon as possible. It has been a long time, you know, he hasn't played. As the report says, it have been eleven games in all competitions that Usman Dembele hasn't featured. 
So it is time that we really hope that he recovers. And we know Javi really likes Dembele a lot and he really wants him to come back as soon as possible. Of course, non we can't deny the fact that at some games we have been missing Dembele's services. Nobody can deny that fact, but we just hope that you know he can come back, return to action and continue to help the team to win games. Then on to the next story of discussion, the animosity between La Liga president Javier Tebas and his Barcelona counterpart, Juan Laporta, has reached new heights this year, especially after an investigation that accused Barca of paying former vice president of the referees committee, Enrique Negrera, for insights and even results manipulation. Although Spain's prosecutor's office has found no evidence that suggests Barca were involved in result manipulation, Javier Tebas has called out the club time and time again, even threatening with potential sanctions, including demotions. Tebas most recently called out Laporta for not addressing the Negrera allegations and Barcelona's long silence over the matter. La Liga president has continued his attack on Barcelona once again today, stating that the Negrera scandal sets a bad outlook not only for Barcelona, but also for Spanish football in general, he said. Laporta is seeing ghosts. When there are none, it doesn't look good. The case is harming and will continue to harm not only Barca's, but the reputation of all clubs in La Liga, he said. His comments come a few days after UEFA confirmed its own investigation over Barcelona and their potential involvement in the scandal. Reports suggest Javier Tebas has, was highly involved in influencing the European footballing authority to look into this matter. Although Barcelona have indeed remain silent on the matter. They are collecting information and have launched several external investigations of their own. The idea is to make President Laporta appear before the press, most likely in the month of April. Laporta has hinted recently that Barcelona have the evidence and are ready to not only defend themselves, but also to attack if necessary. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.